Hi there, and welcome to this day in history for February 5th. February 5th is the 36th day of the year in the Gregorian calendar, with 329 days remaining to the end of the year, or 330 if it happens to be a leap year. Today's word is quotidian. Quotidian is an adjective that means occurring every day, like a quotidian fever, belonging to each day, every day, ordinary or mundane, as in a quotidian routine, commonplace or ordinary, as in quotidian drabness. The word quotidian comes to us through Middle English, Anglo-French before that, originally from Latin words that meant every and day, every day. First known use of the word quotidian is in the 1300s, quotidian. Remember, if you have a word you'd like to see in this Word of the Day segment, drop it in the comments, and we'll give it a good going over. And with that, on February 5, 1907, at a meeting of the American Chemical Society, Belgian chemist Leo Bakeland announced the creation of a synthetic plastic, which he called Bakelite. This was an inexpensive, non-flammable, and versatile plastic, and yes, he did name it after himself. The invention and introduction of this product marked the beginning of the modern plastics industry. Bakelite could be molded and hardened into any shape, did not conduct electricity, and was heat resistant. It was used in electrical insulators, radio casings, kitchenware, jewelry, pipe stems, and children's toys, just to name a few things. Can you even imagine a time before plastic? This was a revolutionary development for sure. These days, items made of or containing actual original Bakelite are quite collectible. Mexico adopted its current constitution on February 5, 1917, establishing a federal republic with independent executive, legislative, and judicial branches. This is the birthday of American singer and songwriter Barrett Strong, Jr., born February 5, 1941, in West Point, Mississippi. His dad was a minister, and the family moved to Detroit when Barrett was four years old. He co-wrote such hits as I Heard It Through the Grapevine, War, Just My Imagination Running Away With Me, and Papa Was a Rolling Stone, which earned him a spot in the Songwriters Hall of Fame, but is perhaps best known for his recording of the song Money, That's What I Want, which we'll talk more about in just a minute. Mr. Strong has four albums and some 19 singles to his name and later helped up-and-coming young artists get their start in the music biz. Barrett Strong passed away in 2023 at the age of 81. I've been making these episodes for a while, so if you're curious as to what I might have mentioned for February 5th before, I'll leave a link for you. Today's song is called Money, That's What I Want by Barrett Strong. Barrett Strong was one of the first artists signed to Barry Gordy's Tamla Records label, a subsidiary of the Motown label. Barrett played the piano and sang on this 1959 recording, and it ended up being the first hit single for Motown. Money, That's What I Want, has been covered by several artists since then, most notably the Beatles in 1963 and the Flying Lizards in 1979. We've talked about the Flying Lizards version before, and, of course, there are several other covers as well. But today's spotlight shines on the 1959 recording of Money, That's What I Want by Barrett Strong. Link in the description. And I think that's going to do it for us today. Thank you so much for watching. Consider subscribing if you haven't already. Feel free to share this video with a link in your email, messaging, or social media. If you enjoy this series, check out the playlist that contains these videos, and I'll put a link to that in the description. The description lives on YouTube, so for other platforms, I'll include a link to my blog page that's called No Really. <laughs> you can also find me on Rumble, BitChute, and Odyssey. All those links in that description. Alrighty, that's all I can think of right now. Thanks again and all. See you next time.
This is the birthday. I didn't get that. Could you try again? I wasn't talking to you. John, me are you kidding me? Okay, hold on. We got to make that be quiet. You got to read what's... Read the black part. <laughs> Hi there, and welcome to this day in history for... Oh, where's your microphone? Okay. We don't want to say the same thing twice. Oh, get your microphone. <laughs> what is it with you and this microphone? Okay, here we go. Okay, we are still recording. That's great. Okay. How about that? <laughs> well, I have a lot to edit today. Cacophony is a sound. <laughs> Cacophony is a noun that you got to read it the right way. Let's start over. <laughs> it's 8 o'clock, so all of the reminders are going to be dinging. I forgot to turn those off. <laughs> okay, stop it. Don't alienate people who can be helpful to you. Flinging happiness all over the place. All right back to work i think we got it this time 